Thank you, Madam Speaker. I rise today to share the story of Raina Norman, whose endometriosis was so advanced by the time she had surgery that the scarring was the worst case her surgeon has ever seen. Raina spent many years from puberty until her late 30s dealing with the pain of endometriosis. Often ignored, she said. It was like someone had wrapped barbed wire around me and was continually cinching it. She suffered from pelvic floor dysfunction, bladder problems, and issues with nerves and ligaments causing back and leg pain. She also had two miscarriages which caused a great deal of emotional pain. When she became pregnant with her son and gave birth via, via C-section, she heard the doctors describing black marks on her uterus they didn't understand. She knew it was endometriosis. In January of this year, Raina finally had the surgery she has needed for years. Her organs were fused and endometriosis was threatening her kidney. Doctors couldn't believe her damaged uterus had been able to carry a baby to term. Nova Scotia needs more qualified specialists. For so, so the long, painful wait times for help for endometriosis, endometriosis that Raina experienced could be reduced. May all the members of this house work together to raise awareness so to ensure no other Nova Scotians have to wait the way Raina has.